Welcome to Devotional Daily. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe to our videos. Today is October 21. Our title is The Value of Joy. Unless the Lord builds the house, they labor in vain who build it. Unless the Lord guards the city, the watchman stays awake in vain. Psalm 127 verse 1. I mentioned earlier that for C.S. Lewis, joy is the serious business of heaven. But joy is also the serious business of Christians on earth. Without it, marriages don't work. When work isn't accompanied by delight, it becomes intolerable and dehumanizing. Nothing is more disheartening than children who, overwhelmed by dysfunctional adults, have lost the joy that should so strongly mark their growth. Without joy, the church becomes unbearable and religion merely drags on in dry lives. When the Christian life lacks delight, it is unlikely to be spiritual. Millions of people, after achieving everything they've dreamed of, find themselves asking, is this all there is? If we want to get the most out of life, we must learn to prioritize what truly matters. Often, we miss out on the best life has to offer because we are distracted by relatively insignificant things. The father who is so consumed by his work that he has no time to play with his little daughter may one day realize, too late, that he missed out on one of life's greatest joys. The mother who, obsessed with keeping the house clean and tidy, becomes neurotic, full of self-pity, constantly scolding her little boy for his innocent messes, will one day see that she lost the opportunity to laugh and enjoy those precious moments with him, some of the most cherished experiences of motherhood. Couples who are solely focused on building their nest egg, when that means long periods away from family intimacy, will one day realize that in trying to gain, they have lost. In their pursuit of material dreams, they will discover too late that they let something of priceless value die. Read today's text again and reflect upon it.